Hi, I'm Kimberly Melton with Visual Story Media. Today, we're going to talk about the day in the life of a photo manager. While it's not glamorous, it sure is fun. A photo manager helps you organize your photos and digital images, but the fun part is unlocking the memories. What's in that floppy drive? What's on that VHS tape? What's on the cassette tape? It's a lot of fun, and we have the equipment that can help you do it. So, let's get started. First, we have the DV cassette. Now, the way that I unlock this is I have the original camera, I have special equipment on my computer, and I use a special old computer because the equipment is actually more suited to this older format. Now, besides the DV, we have the Hi8, the big brother. The Hi8 has another special camera or video that we use to be able to transfer the information from here to the computer and to a special program that handles this. It takes these files, both of them, and turns them into MP4 files, which are video files, actually files that you can see. In addition, I also have compact flashcards. Oh my gosh, there's this, there's this kind, there's this kind. What these devices did was you put them in your camera and the photos that you took downloaded and then you took this and put it in this piece of equipment and downloaded your photos to your computer. It was an arduous process, but absolutely worth it because then you didn't have to pay to actually have your photos developed. Let's see what's next. Remember these cassettes? I think the first cassette player I had was pink. <laughs> now, these can hold a lot of different kinds of memories. Um, your child singing its first song or maybe a professional one with a band that you don't have access to anymore. I know for me, I taped my grandmother telling me stories of her family and our history. And I took those and I transferred these tapes to MP3 files, which are audio only files. I have a special cassette that hooks to my computer and I have another special program that really helps us unlock those special memories. Remember these? Oh my God, zip files came out in 1994. Now, a zip file was kind of like our thumb drive today. It held a lot of information. 100 megabytes, a big old file at that time. Most of these were used to store Word documents, data, things like that. But I have a large piece of equipment here that can um, help us unlock what's in these zip files. The wonderful little floppies. Yes. Floppies were the workhorse for many, many, many years. Unfortunately, they don't last very long, but um, you these also contain various things. Um, photos, Word documents, images, songs, you name it, you could put it on there. I have a special piece of equipment for that. And again, it hooks to my computer and I'm able to transfer these files to modern day files. Whew. We're not through, let's see what else. CDs, lots of CDs. <laughs> Again, much like the floppy, the CD was able to hold an, a lot of information. Um, we had Word documents, we had photos, movies. A lot of our movies uh, came to us on CDs. Here's my piece of equipment for that. Again, I can put this to my computer. I have a special program that will transfer the files over so all those wonderful memories can be unlocked. Ah, uh, the VHS tape. What a wonderful thing. How many times have you re-recorded over your old VHS tapes? <laughs> 
So for a VHS tape, what I do is I have my VCR, I pop the tape in, um, it gets transferred to this wonderful little machine who helps me take what is a VHS and turn it into an MP4. Lots and lots of equipment, but well worth it. Let's see what's next on our tour. What do we have here? The Big Chill, my favorite album. Now, we don't have record players in our living rooms like we used to, but we sure might have some albums that can't be replaced or you can't hear that music anywhere else. Well, that's where this machine comes in. It hooks to my computer and will take the information from this fabulous Motown record and transfer it so I can listen to it on my computer. Yay, Motown. Slides. Ah, the wonderful slide. Well, slides actually were invented in 1849, but the modern slide that we know today was invented in 1965. This is a special piece of equipment I have to be able to scan my slides on. And you just pop the slide in there. The light is super, super bright. And this is actually a picture of my parents' wedding. Slides are wonderful because many times they're dated. They can help us identify. But the best thing about slides are the color. They're rich and vibrant in a wonderful, wonderful way to scan and get your old pictures. I think I saved the best for last. Photos. This is a photo of my grandmother and her two sisters that were born in the mountains of North Carolina around 1910. Photographs tell so many wonderful stories, but they are precious and they can be ruined, they can be lost, they can be wet, they can burn in fires. But if you have them online, that doesn't happen and you've saved your family's legacy. This is my scanning equipment. I had I camera scan versus um, mechanical scan, and I have special equipment for that with lights, etc. I have an old, old um, photo book here, an album with that horrible glue that can make your pic uh, really ruin your pictures, and I have special equipment that will take that off. Also, scrapbooks. Scrapbooks can either be taken just as they are, or they can be, um, the things from it can be removed and you can digitize it that way. There's multiple ways that you can save your photos and memories. Bye, Grandma. This is an example of 437 items that a client recently gave me. I used almost all of the equipment that we went over today. It certainly was a big job and took up a lot of room in his house. But now, after we've transposed, digitized, transferred, etc., etc., all those items now fit on one external hard drive. It was a big job, but it was absolutely worth it, and the client is thrilled. Thank you so much for joining me today and letting me tell you what the day in the life of a photo manager is. If I can help you unlock your memories, please don't hesitate to give us a call. Visual Story Media, where we bring a second life to your treasured memories. Thank you.